I'm Adam. And I'm Sugar. And this, this is, is Where There's a Williams There's a Way. Hey Sugar, what do you think about butterflies? They are majestic beings floating through the air. But they're also so fragile, I always worry that something's going to come along and step on it. They seem to be pretty aware of their surroundings. I don't know if I've accidentally stepped on a butterfly in my life. I've got a very quiet step. You never know. Well, in today's book, we get to see the unsavory side of butterflies. Let's get started. Butterflies are pretty. Gross. By Rosemary Mosco. Illustrated by Jacob Suba. Hi, I'm a butterfly, and everyone knows that butterflies are pretty. We flutter through meadows, we pose on fancy flowers, we show off our wings, we shimmer with all the colors of the rainbow. So majestic. Don't you look lovely? Oh, go on. Yes, butterflies are beautiful. Is that all you wanted to know about butterflies? Great, then. Don't turn the page. Close this book, you're done, the story's over, nothing to see here. Huh, he kept reading. Well, there's much more you could learn about butterflies. The truth would surprise you, it would gross you out. Don't read any further unless you're ready for the real story. This is your last chance to close this book. Don't say I didn't warn you, because I did. I warned you. Here we go. Some butterflies are gross. They eat rotten food. They land on moldy fruit and slurp up the juices. They also eat dead animals. The slimier, the better. Mmm, deliciously disgusting. Ew, gross. Did you see that fish? What's wrong with fish? Nothing, I love fish. At least when it's fresh. That thing was moldy and disgusting. You don't want to eat sushi you've left out on the counter for two weeks. Yeah, I'm with you there. Some butterflies are drab. They're gray or white or brown. Some of them even look like dead leaves to help them hide from hungry birds. Shh. Some butterflies are noisy. If you walk past a red cracker butterfly, prepare for a surprise. It may fly toward you and make a noise with its wings. Pretty peculiar, right? Oh, but there's so much more I haven't told you. You can still turn back. You can close this book. It's up to you. Okay, prepare to get weirded out. Butterflies are shapeshifters. Baby butterflies hatch from eggs. Hello, world! They're called caterpillars. They eat and grow. Nom, nom, nom. When they get big enough, their skin hardens and they turn into chrysalises. Under the hard shell, they grow new body parts. Hmm, how many legs should I make? I'll try six. Soon they burst through the shell. Now they have wings. Time to fly! Grrr. Some caterpillars are carnivorous. Caterpillars love to eat and eat. Most caterpillars chomp on leaves, but some of them are meat eaters. They hunt bugs. Some caterpillars are stinky. A giant swallowtail caterpillar looks like bird poop. When somebody frightens it, the caterpillar sticks out two stinky tentacles to scare them away. This friendship stinks. Some caterpillars are sneaky. The Alcon blue caterpillar smells and sounds like an ant. Ants think that the caterpillar is an ant too. The ants babysit the caterpillar until it grows up. Hey, you're not an ant. No, I'm fraudulent. There's nothing wrong with one species growing up with another. I used to have a pet kitten. I have a dog, truck. Exactly. That's not cool. You shouldn't have to trick someone to help you out. I agree. It's too bad that the Alcon Blue Caterpillar doesn't just establish a good working environment. I guess the ants working as indentured servants is why the book is exposing the butterflies as less than honorable creatures. Pop secret. Well, now you know the truth, and you don't have to hear anymore. Goodbye, so long, have a nice day. 
Oh, you're still here. Do you want to learn more? Fine. Here comes the really strange stuff. Some butterflies have butts that look like heads. This is the red banded hair streak. Can you guess which end is the front and which is the back? It's tricky. The butterfly's back wings have fake eyes and antenna. The butterfly waggles its back wings in the air. A hungry spider thinks the butterfly butt is its head and attacks the butt. The butterfly escapes sometimes, leaving parts of its butt behind. Fool you! Butterflies taste with their feet. A monarch butterfly mom stomps on a plant to taste the leaves. If they're yummy, she lays her eggs on them. She's making sure that her babies will have a lot of food to eat once they hatch. My feet say it's sweet. What if your parents stuck their feet in your cereal before you ate it? Some butterflies eat poop. They snack on salt and other tasty stuff from big piles of animal dung. I sure love a poopy picnic. Some butterflies drink tears. They sip the water that drips from an animal's eyes. Tears are salty and they need salt to stay healthy. Well, now you know the truth. We butterflies are complicated. We're gross. We're amazing, just like you. And just like you, we're beautiful too. I guess that you could say that most butterflies are just working hard to survive. I hear you there. Sometimes it's all about surviving. I'm not even going to start with the polar ice cap situation. Do you still think that they're majestic creatures? Absolutely. It's hard to deny. Do you still worry about accidentally stepping on them? Not about a couple of them, but it's hard just to shut off the worry. You got a big heart, sugar. That's what happens when you're as big as me. That's not what I meant. I just wish that I could get a little bit more information about the different butterflies that they talked about. That way, I could remember which ones are the bad guys. I don't know if any of them are really bad guys. But regardless, your wish has come true. Stay tuned for more information. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I'm Adam. And I'm Sugar. And, and this, this is Where There's, where a, there's Williams, a Williams There's a Way. There's a way. About the butterflies in this book. Monarch. Look for monarch caterpillars on milkweed plants. They only eat the leaves of milkweeds. Talk about picky eaters. Where to see it? North and South America. Harvester. A female harvester lays her eggs near woolly aphids. When her caterpillars hatch from the eggs, they munch on the aphids. Where to seed it? Eastern North America. Alcon Blue. As a caterpillar, the Alcon Blue uses special chemicals and sounds to imitate an ant. Real ants get tricked into protecting and feeding it. When it transforms into a butterfly, it quickly escapes the ant's nest, shedding special scales to stop the ants from attacking it. Where to see it? Northern Asia and Europe. Red Cracker. This butterfly is blue and white on top, but when it folds its wings together, you'll see a bright fire truck red color. The male red cracker makes a cracking sound like bacon frying in a pan. It probably makes this sound to show off or to chase away other butterflies. Where to see it? From Mexico to Argentina. Giant Swallowtail. This big butterfly has a wingspan about the length of a $5 bill. As a caterpillar, it looks like bird poop. Predators don't want to eat poop, so they leave it alone. Where to see it? Eastern and Southwestern North America. Red banded hair streak. This little butterfly has a fake head with false eyes and antenna on its butt, which is really its back wings. When a hungry jumping spider tries to bite the fake head, the butterfly escapes. Even if a predator tears a chunk out of the back wings, the butterfly can fly just fine. Where to see it? Southeastern United States. Julia Heliaconian. This butterfly slurps up turtle tears to get salt. It needs salt to stay healthy and make its eggs. And its usual food, flower nectar, isn't salty enough. Where to see it? from Florida and Texas south to Brazil. Did you know 
the most common butterfly in the United States is the cabbage white, 